All right, Squeeze Man, I recognize that username for sure. Dwabs, I think, um, bought us out in one of the games we played last night. So we should be up for a good game. Okay, first game of the night. Again, only time for two games tonight, so hopefully we'll make these ones count. Aluminum, iron. Expansive colony founded. Go expansive right here. And you can count on us. Go over here. Drop a mine and am I gonna have space to drop steel right next to the base? No, not if I want to drop down a triangle at some point. Alright, well, hmm. Should I drop a steel triangle? What is everyone else going into at the moment? Robotic, expansive, claiming some geotherms. We can claim a geothermal of our, uh, for ourselves, or we could drop solar there. Uh, right now we don't have the money to pay for any of that. All right, let's drop another steel mill. Just the two, I don't know if I want to go into three. The black so we'll drop that there to hook that up. And we do need to free up some cash. Hopefully by that claim. And we can definitely bid this up as well. Meanwhile, I need to think of what I'm going to do with this claim here. And my aluminum claim did not bounce. Let's go and drop another mine on this. And then what's going to be a good money maker for us here? Uh, we could get into glass. Water seems fairly plentiful. There's a nice high water right by our base, so I don't think we need to get into that right away. Quarries. They're both fairly distant. Let's uh, drop quarry there and then go into glass. Let's see, we can expand out this way. The terrain does stop us from dropping nice triangles for maximum adjacency bonus. That's alright. Ooh, and the claims are still really cheap here. Let's see, do I want to sell down aluminum or steel? We can sell down sell aluminum and a little steel as well. Buy that up. And then we should get into power now. Let's see. This geothermal. Well, let's send a claim over. And we're just short on the steel. That should tick in fairly rapidly. And these guys need to be on auto supply. Um, I think I'll make a post on the official message where it's requesting auto supply activation as soon as you uh, finish or lay down the tile. Um, I also want to see immediate feedback when I tell something uh, to be built. So like the construction vehicle comes out immediately, but if you're far away from the base, you won't see that happening. So you don't know if the computer's responded to your click. Okay, how are we doing? Everyone's at level two. Are we close to the upgrade? We need to buy up some more glass. Glass is currently pretty expensive. Uh, and we need to free up some cash to buy the oxygen to make our own glass legitimately. And when does oh, the black market's unlocked? We should go and sell down some of this. Grab the goon squad. Price of power does justify the goon squad. And maybe we do need some more steel mills. Uh, the claims are only 7,000, but we're not going to get the black market for another 46 seconds. How and Dwabs are at level 3 already. Let's, um, we can definitely bid this up to 
14,000. Sixteen thousand, sure. But that'll be the maximum. Eighteen thousand. Twenty thousand? Nah. Sell down a little of the glass. Grab our upgrade. Steel's still maintaining a good price, so let's um we'll do we'll be able to ship more industries off Earth in no time. Buy a bunch of iron. Sell down the glass, buy up a whole bunch of iron. Um, is someone going to claim, can I race them to that? No, they, they beat me to it. Alright, so uh, let's drop steel mills here, and then scrap this for a solar plant. Right there. And it looks like water, we're going to need to get into water now. Someone had to grab the water right by our base. It's fairly annoying. Let's claim those two. Hopefully that'll make uh, those claims bounce here. So they'll have, the, they'll have wasted some time trying to claim the water right by our base. Uh, but it would be nice if we could get the full triangle going. And let's see. Sell that a little glass. Buy up some more iron. Buy up... Um, hmm. Getting the claim would be nice. Let's see. A little, little iron. Uh, should we just do the upgrade? We should probably just do the upgrade. Right, fine, we'll do the upgrade. And uh, let's see, ban that guy. Robotic colony expanded. Expansive colony expanded. And ban this guy. Uh, just people are posting random suspect. Uh, automatic or shortened URLs in my chat, which is always a bad sign. Uh, let's go and sell some of this stuff down. And we do need to do, uh, power is really expensive, so are is fuel, so we should drop reactors. Let's see, this area is pretty crowded. I guess we'll have to branch it out from our glass, although I really don't like doing that. Two claims left, what do I want to do with this? Uh, should we go into more glass here? For now, I would say yes. And the price of power is justifying dropping another solar. And I'd happily pick this up for under, say, 14,000 would definitely please me. 18,000, I don't want to go beyond that though. Fix that up, drop a geothermal here, drop a goon squad on that. And do we need to free up more money? Yeah, definitely sell down all of this stuff. And if I can get more water extraction going, so one here would save me the fuel, and fuel's pretty expensive right now, so that might be fine. Uh, yeah, so let's get the upgrade here, and drop a pump right here. No adjacency bonus, but uh, that's probably fine. We should get into food as well. Hmm. A couple farms in here, or maybe down here. Alright, let's uh, push up the farms while we're waiting. I don't like having everything in a nice little line like this. We don't really have an alternative. And another pump. Drop another cheap goon squad. And we can uh, dedicate one more tile to solar. There's a shortage surplus. Iron surplus. Alright, let's buy up a bunch of that since uh, steel is still fairly expensive. That's probably enough though. In fact, if that's going to keep on crashing, let's uh, buy up a whole bunch, scrap this, put solar in there instead. And yeah, the price of power is still really good. Let's drop a solar over here. Right, these guys need water, start auto supply. Yeah, 
We call to dirty rat trying to break our stuff. Expanded. And we still have one after this thing here. Let's see. Oh, mutiny. This guy right there. And um, this guy's super cheap. Let's buy him up. The black and then we'll so buy some of this down, pay down some of our debt, sell down some of the food. And what's going on? Why is the game lagging on me? Okay, what does this guy got going? Uh, definitely good stuff. I'm pleased with this entire setup, so let's drop some more water pumps here. Uh, we inherited, or we stocked about a large amount of very valuable glass, and we do need to check the off world prices. Uh, oxygen and fuel are going for a good price. Grab that for 7,000 and with one claim here, let's do a little defensive stock buying and then pay down all of our debt here. Alright, and we can drop ourselves... Uh, we don't need to upgrade yet, but um, do I want to well, buy up a green squad uh, for protecting the off-world? Making good money off power. Let's see what else do we need here. Let's sell all that silicon. Our glass was powered down. Um, we can drop another reactor here and upgrade the next time we swing around. And so what would I want to protect? Where are people likely to drop their EMPs, power surges, and the like? Uh, we'll just save that. Okay, so we'll take the upgrade. Hey, Pop Spiffy. To the infrastructure boost you approved. And uh, oxygen. It's worth quite a lot. Ooh, that kind of hurt. Now uh, let's drop this right here and we'll put out another reactor where we can get the more adjacency bonuses going. But we should um, start stacking things around our acquisition. Let's see. If we want to. Well, definitely more water. Get that going, and then off-worlds. I think it is time for off-worlds. Your stock is being bought. Now we can turn the farms off. All right, so Dwabs is starting to buy into me here, so we'll start buying into Styland to get Dwabs. And do we want to get our off-world going? Yes, we do. So we'll go and drop that right over here. Put the Goon Squad on that. Goon Squad, please. And uh, turn the farms back on. Off. Do the plot. Random water in the middle of nowhere. Sure, I can get on that. In fact, let's uh, drop some more water pumps. And what happened to my, oh, we need iron. These guys should be on auto supply. Start auto supply. Sell them what glass we have. Hmm, how much does Dwabs have going for himself? Not a lot, and we should soon be able to start shipping stuff off world, so I'm not too worried there. Let's see, the final buyout is 100,000. Uh, in resources, could we sell everything and get them? No, not yet. No claims. Uh, we're gonna go and ship 
Let's see. Let's buy up some oxygen and ship that. And turn the farms back on, definitely. Okay, sell this down. Put some of that. Some of the water too, sure that's fine. Do I want to start getting into electronics? Uh, yes, I could go and scrap the solar. That would be fine. And is there anything else that's less profitable that I could replace this with? No, it's, it's all fine. Let's go grab a mutiny while we're at it. How's got... Mm, and likely Goon Squad protected as well. Okay, what are our resources at? We could go buy this guy out, and then we would have dwabs as well. Then we'd be really safe. Okay, let's constantly be shipping food. Double ship food, and we'll go and sell down the oxygen. Sell down a little aluminum, a little steel, a whole bunch of glass. And are we close to the buyout? Not quite yet. Let's keep an eye on how, since he does have that off world up. We could go maybe nuke some of this stuff down. Or over here, that's not bad either. Alright, we'll keep an eye on that. In the meantime... Alright, we'll buy out Stylin, and then we'll buy out Dwabs, and then we'll be in a really safe position. Let's see, we've got one claim, and with that claim we could drop another off-world if we stopped selling off all the resources that are required to build off-worlds. Um, is there anything worth stealing? Yeah, we could steal a whole bunch of stuff from this guy, although he could just hook it up later. Uh, he does the steel. Steel's worth a decent amount. We could go to like 16,000 for this. Oh, we did get the pirates, alright. So let's uh, go and steal that. And sell some of this stuff down, buy out dwabs. And uh, we'll need to take a look at our acquisitions, make sure they're making things that make sense to us. And it's not really the most exciting stuff. And dwabs, let's have a look at him. Uh, dwabs is making a lot of nice electronics there, and there's a shortage coming through. Let's switch this on to auto supply, and that'll work out well for us. Patent Labs, we could go and grab ourselves a superconductor. Uh, sure, why not? Uh, nanotech would be nice, but um, let's grab a superconductor. The price of power is starting to go up. And keep buying in here. Put up an off world. We'll hide that uh, over here. And. Let's see, sell down some of that food, all that oxygen, much of the water, all the glass, all these electronics, and we'll concentrate on buying it how next. Uh, but we'll buy up Screeve Man while he's cheap, at least uh, 30%. And I'm gonna switch this water over to food. And how's the glass for the silicon? That's still fine. Power is still fine. Uh, this needs to be repaired or replaced with the farm. We'll just repair that. Um, but what about my other stuff? Alright, so we can switch more of our water over to farms then. And I'm going to go and EMP this guy down. Alright, now that's defended. Kind of surprising, but uh, that's fine. Sell this down and Look at all the money. Go four shipments. And we'll go grab Nanotech would be nice. Look cold at fusion money. thinking machines. Let's grab um, fuels, not that expensive. We'll grab thinking machines, although no one's really throwing sabotage at us right now. So the buyout cost here, we're halfway there. What if we sold everything? Cash and resources, we're really close. Uh, 
All right, let's get another off-world going then. We can go and scrap the solar panel. Get that off-world there. And are we shipping maximum food off-world wise? Yes, we are. All right, so I just bought out Scree Van. We got some money off of that. So we should be able to purchase them right now. All right, good game.